was community almost everything? Was it a smorgasbord? Good, bad, good for you, bad for you? Oh, yeah, but definitely a net positive. You, you, you won't hear me complaining about having that experience at all. A lot of regrets about, uh, for instance, what you mentioned, like, like my public... Um, kind of silliness with with Chevy that was you know me being unprofessional and com combined with like pretty bad luck about who was recording what and leaking what to the internet when I did something that was sort of I I, I played voicemails that I was getting from him in the midst of a little fight I was having with him it was my attempt to therapeutically like turn something that was kind of eating away at me into laughter for a hundred people now you say it's wrong uh, yeah, yeah, of course. It, I've since realized that the I grew up on the internet, and for most of my life, the internet was a place to hide from the world, and it was a place where nerds were empowered um, because it was it, it was a, it, there was more secrecy to it. And in your wildest dreams, you would ever say something that would all of a sudden get the country's attention. So when I was 25, I would blog and I would I would I would I would name names because I, I, I just it was a different culture. And it was that Chevy experience that finally made me realize, oh, I my right to swing my fist ends at the other people's noses. Most, I can't most, involve other people in my compulsion for transparency. Was Chevy difficult to work with? Yeah, I mean, I think if, I, I, I wish he was sitting here so that that didn't seem scandalous to say because I, I doubt he would disagree. I mean, I, th I think that's one of his charms, too, is that when he walks into the room, he, the, the temperature changes. I mean, he, he's unignorable. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, on demand on Aura TV and Hulu.